Thank you so much for joining us on ITV Gold today. Um, you know, my first question to you has to be, South Asian kids and Asian American kids are looking forward to you making history and giving them the first Asian superhero. What do you hope they take from Shang-Chi? Um, I think a sense of pride. I think a sense of belonging and a sense that anything is possible because once you see yourself as a superhero, um, the you know the possibilities are truly endless, and uh, you know I can't tell you how much it would have meant for me growing up to have seen you know myself represented in that way, and and, and growing up in Canada, consuming mostly Western media, you know the, the the truth and reality was that we didn't have that representation, and uh, I'm I'm very excited that you know today in 2021 we're we're finally able to give that to to children and adults everywhere. We're going to incorporate a lot of different styles of martial arts. Tai Chi, which is very, very flowy. Another one is Wing Chun, which is a bit more combative. And then looking at certain regional styles that kind of fill in this mosaic of how this character moves. Run it! Of course, and how amazing it is to see an all-Asian cast and a lot of people in the crew as well. My next question to you has to be about the fact that this movie is not only a spectacle, but it's also a very intense family drama. And it's about a father and a son relationship. How much of your own experience do you think you used in creating that relationship? And how was the experience like working with Tony? Oh my goodness. Uh, so much of my own personal experience went into the creation of this movie. I mean, mind you, I was not uh, raised from birth to be an assassin. I was not taught every possible way to kill a man. But uh, you know, I was I was raised with expectations, and and I think um, raised in in a household where, you know, the values that my parents uh, espoused and were and were raised with uh, were very different than than the values that I was uh, kind of uh, exposed to in a, in a different country. So, um, you know, that led to a lot of moments of tension uh, between us, a lot of arguments, and and really just like conversations about different parents expectations and and how you know i fit into all of this so um definitely a lot of that that pain but ultimately that love went into you know the character of sean and also the dynamic between sean and his father win Wu. the world has no idea what they're up for it's time for you to take your place by my side that's not going to happen Right, you know, South Asians are watching you across the nation, Simu. What's your message to them in finding their representation? They are looking up to you. This is the first step. Oh my goodness. Well, that, uh, that's an incredible thing to say, and I'm, I'm very, very humbled by that. Um, I, would say, I would say this, um, you know, be the master of your own destiny. Don't wait for opportunity to come knocking at your door. Fight for what you want. And, uh, and generate your own opportunity. And where a door isn't open for you, Build your own and then open that one. 